Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing the Those Who Remain tutorial. As you can tell, I'm on my alt account because my name is different and I'm just going to be playing regular today. So I'm just going to click play and it'll just bring me to a random server. I've done nothing on this account. I only have the default weapons, the song of shotgun, the G17, stuff like that. I have no money, no experience. I don't even have any of the game passes. So this is going to be from this is going to be from the bottom what I'm doing. And if you looked at my tips video, you'll know that I said to mainly play the objective and go to classic and then hardcore when you can because more spawns that won't apply to this video only the the classic and hardcore bit that won't apply what will apply is everything else i had said other than playing with friends i'm playing with randoms because i actually have nobody else friended on this account so as you can see son of shotgun g17 2x4 and no perks oh and as you can tell three slots so i don't have any game passes or anything like that this guy's placing down barbed wire at the end of the wave so that's amazing <laughs> i honestly didn't know what to expect what i would say to go for would be probably the M1 Thompson, and that requires you to get to level 13. But I would go for... the Mac 10 right here. That's only level 8. So... Okay. So we're going to see what the objective is, and see if we can get it done. Escort, okay. By the way, rem you, it, it'll be helpful to remember that you can't actually shoot during during these little animations. It just won't let you, so uh, that can get you killed. Oh, he went backwards. I hate when the escort does that. <gasps> My friend is so the G17 is actually better on the reload compared to the Sama. And it does have more ammo anyways, so. should be good. You can stay around them and then after a while when you're completed with it, you'll be able to just... You'll, you'll get the bonus either way since you've been around the escort for a while. I don't know what he's saying. The double barrel seems like a Pretty quick reload to me. Oh. Though it does get annoying that you can only fire two shots. So I suppose... Uh, the end of this video will be when... Oh, there we go, level 5. Almost already caught up to keep more. I already have five thousand dollars to my name.
Oh, by the way, those count as hazmats. And another thing I failed to mention is you actually have to aim above their heads in order to do damage to their heads. Level seven or level six. There we go, already level eight. It's really easy starting out, but it can actually get it gets fairly difficult as time goes on, but here we go. Already got the Mac 10, and that's I'd say there's really no point in getting this weapon, L9H. There's it really doesn't change anything. I think the G17 is your best bet for current gameplay. Oh. Uh, hopefully we can make it to that. I mean, the radio's right there. But everybody also wants experience. Yeah, I think that's guy. I think that guy's going to the radio. And it's better to use your secondary on this. Better to use your secondary on this than it is to actually use your primary. Alright, we got a good bit of damage on that. Time to go to the radio. Make it. That way I can get both objectives done. Though it depends how many. Yep, there was a lot of people over there. See what I mean? They all. Everybody always goes for the radio over almost anything else. Where's that gonna land? Probably in the back. Or probably around here, who knows? Probably right here. Yeah, right here.
that's a player. Out of ammo. Almost. Ammo? Ah, nerf gas. Oh, I guess I'll just use the 2x4 if I really need to. Oh, yes I do. It's really not recommended to do this. I'm out of ammo. I got nothing else to use. There we go. Now we can equip our first perks. So basically, you get the gist of it. Um, it was fairly easy to get to here. Only took about, you know, however long the game was it only took like 10 minutes and uh yeah i would save up for the serbu super shorty that i have it and i would save up for the thompson m1 and these would be my starter weapons the mac 10 is good except you can barely see through that site at least i can't the thompson would just as you can see here has a slower fire rate that's better faster reload time Less recoil. It actually has bullet punch, so you can actually pierce through zombies quicker and get more collaterals. Has a bit more damage, from what you can tell. And overall, it's just an upgrade from the Mac 10. But I would go straight for the Mac 10 and then go for the M1, and that's what I would do as a beginner. And as always, thank you all for watching. Uh, I know this was fairly quick video but it is a tutorial video and I'll see you guys in the next one